This is Stu Ellis with your Illinois Corn Connection, brought to you by Illinois Corn Growers. What do we do if we run into a, sorry, we don't have that product? Yeah, that's going to be something that I think we're going to be dealing with uh, this year, and people should be ready for that. And one of the things, I guess, quote unquote nice things uh, that we have uh, available to us are many different products that will be efficacious on whatever it is we're looking for. So, you know, I think one one of the things that we're going to have to or, or growers are going to have to keep in mind are what are the options that we have available to us, you know, through whoever it is we're purchasing our products from and what are the strengths and weaknesses of those uh, those different products. Okay, and as we look at some of the alternatives, and we don't find the ones we want, uh, but you say that those Plan Bs are still fairly strong and should should work. Right. Yeah, and and let's just talk you know, fungicides for a minute. We'll just we'll say corn. It's a real easy crop, right? We usually go on with one, maybe maybe two applications. One of the nice things about a lot of the products out there is they're they're fairly similar in terms of the mode of action um, and the active ingredients and the mode of action as well as the overall um, activity there is you know subtle differences there but they they can still be effective in keeping down those those foliar fungal diseases that are going to be causing you issues and uh, promoting yield and so just because you can't get your favorite product uh, doesn't mean that you know you can't use something else that might be available and still not have a good experience with it. Some of those have three different uh, factors in them and they could uh, uh, they could be pretty powerful in keeping the like tar spot down. Right, and those and those products, you know, with, with three modes of action, obviously they're also good in terms of uh, reducing your risk of resistance development to fungicide active ingredient modes of action as well. So. That was your Illinois Corn Connection. I'm Stu Ellis. To learn more about how Illinois corn is working for you, visit www.ilcorn.org.